We're going to roll up our sleeves and go work. Texas Representative Sylvia Garcia demanded answers as she volunteered at a Houston food bank Saturday with her colleagues, Sheila Jackson Lee and New York's Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez. Texans do not want to go through this again. They want accountability. They want to know why the system failed and quite frankly, almost broke. Garcia is calling for an independent investigation into massive power failures after the winter storm left millions in the dark and cold, many lacking food and water. Five days before the winter storm hit, ERCOT assured that, quote, we are ready for the cold temperatures coming our way. Texas Governor Greg Abbott Friday seemed to blame ERCOT, the nonprofit cooperative that manages almost all of the Texas power grid. We will be looking in Washington for a full federal investigation. Many Texans remain under advisory to boil tap water before drinking it. I have no water coming in my home whatsoever. I've got six little ones that I need to take care of. Houston officials are testing water samples. We'll be able to uh, um, determine whether or not we have any bacteria growth in the system and we'll be able to, to lift that boil water notice as soon as we get the all clear. Here we go. Mission Dallas, Texas. As the weekend arrived, so did help from thousands of miles away. Charity workers from a Jewish organization in New Jersey drove through the night to deliver traditional Friday night Shabbat meals for a Dallas congregation. Michael George, CBS News. And President Biden said he plans to travel to Texas next week, but doesn't want his visit to distract from recovery efforts.